Hello everybody, it's me, it's me, it's DAB, the one and only, and welcome back to the Disguise 2 LP. Now then, last time we had a lot of story and exposition to get through. We are Adele, the demon hunter, who now has uh, the Overlord Xenon's child, Rosalind, princess of his netherworld. We got a few uh, warriors by our side, we got a fighter, we got a red skull, and we have a cleric. Let's not waste any more time, let's just jump right on into this. Hit that first tutorial. Even this place is getting overrun with monsters. Is Zenon's curse getting stronger? I better hurry before everyone loses their memories and turns into real monsters. You fool. Take you to my father? Do you think I would blindly obey you? All enemies shall meet with death. These lowly monsters shall feast on you. Then I shall finally be free of these odious circumstances. <laughs> What are you doing? You dolts! I am the daughter of Overlord Zenon! Such a violent act shall not be forgiven! Like we care, dude! Our boss is gonna take out Overlord Zenon! So eat pretty bombs, dude! What did you say? Are you confessing to be lackeys of some charlatan plotting to kill my father? You got it, dude. We're lucky we found you out here, dude. Hey! What happens now? Obviously, we kick their ass. Problem. I... I do not know how to fight. You're joking, right? I do not joke with peasants. Alright guys, um... I'm gonna say hell no. You know how this goes. I'm gonna do all the tutorial levels. I'm gonna record them for you. Excuse me, hiccups. I don't need it. I can give you the skinny on it. You pick any of your five characters to dispatch. You get up to ten per level, unless there's certain restrictions that don't allow you to do that. You go up to the enemy, you attack them with physical attacks. If you have ranged weapons, you can use ranged weapons. I'll talk about that as we get to it. As you recall in Disgaea 1, I'm hoping if you watched it, Laharl could, uh... Laharl used a sword, and you start off with Edna. She had... Spears, and then you had three printies that weren't that good to start off. This is so much better because we get Adele who can attack up close. We get Razi who does. Eh, this has a range of effect now. Really? Oh, that's right. This is this guy too. It's only uh, straight attacks. Hold on. Yeah, we can line up to that printy. We should be good. We attack him? Yeah! Alright, Astaroth. Prepare to get it. Del, you attack this one. We'll just bring everybody out for a little fun, just in case. Ernest. Let him get a little extra. And we'll just end our turn. Alright, who wants a taste? Ready, dude. Now, as you can see, that's a team attack. Uh, if you're allied with a teammate... They're more likely, um, if it's one of your teammates and you've, like, been really closely connected, you might do a team attack. You can do more damage that way. But Adele's got them mad counterattacks and just stole Rozzy's kill. I would like Rozzy to get some kind of experience this fight, so we're gonna... 
Shoot Mildred right in the face. Everybody's starting off so weak. Adele, punch him in the back of the head. Yeah, that's it. Then we'll go ahead and, you know what, maybe we'll let Red Skull get in on some of this. Well, no, hold on. Yeah, we'll let him. He's going to have the hardest time exp getting experience early on. And hey, nothing happened anyways. Okay, we got a new sword. Uh, no, we're not going to skip any story. This part might go a little long, too. I guess I don't have to have volume up. Adele, you're back. The shops are open now. The shops? What? You don't know about shops? Rosalind, then let me explain it to you, honey. Yes, I'd like that. I don't need shops explained. I'm going to just blaze past this. Weapons, armor, healing items. Well, just items in general. I don't need this. We're going to skip past it. I want to go through this as quick as we can. Skipping it. We don't need it. It is that simple. And I don't think we can go to the item room for quite some time. And you heal up after every fight. I always do anyways. In the Disguy games, you can always keep everybody fully healed up. Let's do that real quick. I guess they thought this needed a tutorial. Alright, and heal everybody. No prize yet. Alright. Let's do the next level. Now, once we get through all the tutorials... Hold on, is there a story? There is. Um, which tutorial is this? Let's see which tutorial it is. Um, oh, okay. Am I just waiting for people to come beat the crap out of me? Because I can let that happen. Because Adele about to mess you up with them counters. Let's split some experience. Okay, hold on. There we go. The mage, temporarily known as Ernest, get out there. There's a 50% chance they'll team up together. Rozzy, get on out here. So you can shoot that one in the back in the face. And we'll have Madeline come out. Pick up Archibald. Throw him a few feet. So he may just attack this Prenny and maybe get a team up with Rosalind. Let's see what happens. Alright. I guess I did skip the tutorial. <laughs> oh well. It's whatever. Um, I really want her to get leveled up. Right in the back of the head. Hey bud, get in on this. Madeline, maybe you can. Let's find out. Any team ups? There we go. He's not going to keep using swords, though. Replica spear. It's a shame I don't have, intend on having anybody use spears for a while. Hold on one second. While we're here, I don't want our fighter using a sword. We get a so sword wielder later in the game. I like my fighters, personally, using axes. All right, I'm gonna do all the other stuff off screen, and once we get through the first chapter, I'll try to go back to the tutorial. Hold on. Where's that axe? Um, that one's got a gladiator. We'll take it. Okay. Equip this axe real fast. Sort of worse than what we've already got. Well. That axe is better. His hit goes down a little bit. That's fine. 
That's going to help us for now. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Don't run. There we go. Okay, heal up real fast. And back to it. Next tutorial stage. Yeah, we'll view the... Ch no, I can explain this one easy enough. So this is the Geo Panel one. They get an enemy boost 50 there. Experience 50. Alright, hold on. I feel there's a way to do this. Okay, so first off, Madeline, Archibald, Adele. Okay, and Adele can throw this one. Yeah, let's throw that up there. And we'll end the turn. So we'll see what happens here. Hold on. Got that slight enemy boost. Still doesn't make them very strong. They're pretties. And they only got time for none of that anyway, so it's cool. Adele, I want you to take that Geo panel out. Excellent. I really hope it doesn't blow up the other one, but... If it does, yeah, that's fine. It gives us a boost. We didn't need the experience anyways. It's alright. Attack him. Shoot him in the back. Yeah, that's something. Let's try out that new axe of yours. And, uh, Ernest, get out here. You're gonna need a level soon, too. Just end the turn. Ready, dude! Ready, dude! Dude! Yeah, luckily, they're pretty, so you're supposed to just get experience out of them. And we're gonna just go ahead, come around here, shoot you in the head. Finish you off. Okay, yeah, at least we get her to level two. Let's get our red skull in a few levels. I like that you can still do that in this game. And a little fire. Alright, got a little money, got a little experience. Go heal up real fast, I'll be right back. Okay, we're gonna skip the tutorial again. Because this one can get us big Geo com combo. Which is way more useful than just the experience. Okay. What do you do? You nullify. Oh, that's experience 50. Okay, so, first thing we're gonna do. Adele. Lift that. Throw it there. Razi. I know you don't throw it very well, but throw this red skull. Red skull, light it up, buddy. It's only nine hit points. You should be able to kill that in one shot. Let's just take all that experience. Oh, I screwed it up. Damn it. That's fine. Kind of a big bonus going. I was stupid. I forgot. I had to have... I had to have the null panel on there as well, so everything turned blue and then everything would turn nullified. It's, it's whatever. Let's do that now. But, let's bring out our cleric. Burn it. Do attack Agra. 
Then you shoot him. It'll still give us a bonus. Nice. How did that even hurt him? Whatever. We'll end our turn. You really don't want to do this, man. If he has a counter, you're dead. You do. Can we get that orb? Really wish we could have got that orb, but that's cool. We got some power belts. Whoa, whoa, what'd I do? What'd I do? What'd I do? Okay. Okay. So why are you so weak? I mean... You are Overlord Xenon's daughter, right? S Silence! I am the daughter of the legendary Overlord Xenon! But I have never had to fight before! Not even once! I lived in a beautiful mansion with hundreds of servants and everything I ever wanted. So why would I ever need to learn to fight? Fighting is for the lower classes. It is our duty as nobles to use those fights to improve our kingdom and subjects. So, you're the Overlord's precious spoiled daughter. How cliche. But, you must be very important to him. That's right, I am. My father cherishes me. Is it not the same with humans? That is what I have read in my textbooks. Parental love, family love. Were my textbooks wrong? No, they got it right. I'm fighting for my family too. Real talk. There was a manga for this guy too, which... Hold on. Welcome back, Adele. It looks like the Dark Assembly is ready. Dark Assembly? It sounds exciting. At the Dark Assembly, you can submit all kinds of bills into registration if you meet the conditions. If I were you, I'd create a new character at the Dark Assembly first. You want more people to fight with you, right? Having more members will give you a greater advantage in your fights. Since you already have a fighter, Red Skull, and a healer, adding a lady fighter, a blue-green mage, can help balance out your group. It might be fun to include a Prenny or a thief in your group, too. In due time on that one. Let me see something here. Thank you. No prize yet? Alright, that's cool. Are we done with the tutorial fields? Okay, we are. So, what's gonna happen here, guys, is this part was a little... Yeah, it's about where I'd like it to be. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna save the game, I'm gonna change everybody's name, maybe fix their equipment a little tiny bit, how much cash do I have? I have a pretty good amount. And then after I finish this first chapter, that's when I'm gonna start adding some new characters and get them leveled up. But that's gonna be all for this part, thank you for watching everybody, until next time.